The Worldly Madonna is a 1922 American silent drama film directed by Harry Garson and starring Clara Kimball Young and William P. Carlton. A nun at the convent, Janet Trevor plans to save her sister Lucy, who's been framed for murder, by switching places with her. As she steps into the spotlight of the cabaret where her sister works, she discovers a possible victim, John McBride, a politician loved by both. Meanwhile, restaurant entrepreneur Alan Graves threatens McBride and accuses Janet, who mistakes her for Lucy, of having been a witness to the murder that John is accused of. Confessing to the crime is a hunchback named Ramez, but not until the deception of the girls is made public. Graves refuses this offer and accuses Lucy of being a drug addict. Though she confesses to the sin, she denies that neither she nor McBride were involved in the murder. It is soon revealed the victim wasn't murdered at all, but rather bribed to leave the country so that Graves could get McBride in his position. After the presentation of the evidence, McBride confesses his love for Janet while Lucy leads a new, fruitful life thanks to her selfless sister. Clara Kimball Young is Lucy Trevor, dancer slash Janet Trevor, nun. William P. Carlton is John McBride. Richard Tucker is Alan Graves. George Hackathorn is Ramez. Jean DeLimer is Tony Lorenz. William Marion is Dr. Krell. Mila Davenport is Jail Matron. 